At the age of two months, Boris came to our street. His basket was red, his smile was sweet. He wandered around to greet every cat. Life here will be fun, he was quite sure of that. When you wanted him home, no problem, but first you had to promise him a handful of nuts. A cat who loves nuts, that's nuts. But that, in a nutshell, was Boris the cat. What will Boris do next? Boris wakes every day to the tweeting of birds. It's the sweetest sound he ever heard. But if Boris were a bird too, he'd rather be a rooster and cock-a-doodle-doo. Boris the cat is the owner of lands. He has two houses, three parks, and some sand. He leaps over his fence every single day, keeping every trespasser or rebel at bay. If he spots an intruder without missing a beat, he kindly apologizes and finds a retreat. Morning is over. All is okay. But what about the rest of the day? What does Boris do? Who does he meet? Most importantly, what does he eat? Does he have a hobby? Does he ever get bored? The best thing would be to read some more. Boris the cat is an expert in flies. He too would like to leap to the skies. That's why he wants to grow wings of his own. Two wings at least, one would feel so alone. Ever so carefully, the fly lies in his paw. Boris listens to it buzzing. Zing, 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 like a saw. He studies each wing with the utmost patience. His eyes are crossed from sheer concentration. He's almost sure that he figured it out. He knows what flying is all about. He politely says, thank you. Nice to meet you. Goodbye. Go on, little fly friend. It's time to fly. Goodbye. Good for bars. That sound like fun. Always playing with everyone. Let's read on and see what happens when Boris comes home. Sometimes Boris isn't sure how to open the lock with his key. So instead of coming in through the door, he leaps in through the balcony. All over the room, he leaves a trail of mud and flowers in heap but he is too tired to clean it up and happily falls asleep. It's evening now and there comes his plate. Oh, how sad, what a bore. Grains again, that's what I just ate. It's the same meal I had before. If you were I and I were you, would you want to eat only grains too? A raisin or two, that would be nice. Or maybe even a couple of mice. <laughs> the day is over and when Boris goes to sleep, he counts one, two, three fish instead of counting sheep. Good night.